Staying alive is a daily battle for a four-year-old girl in St. Petersburg. Her name is Aurelia, and she relies on multiple medications to keep her alive. Taking Action reporter Jackie Calloway stepped in after her family said they were denied access to one of those drugs. It just tastes like bubble gum. She hates it. So. MLD, a form of dystrophy, attacked Aurelia only at the age of one. Okay, ready? A little bit. We'll do half. The disease, aggressive and often terminal, robbed this four-year-old of the ability to walk or even play with other children. Are there any words to describe the last two years? Um, suffering. In the last suffering. two years, she's battled through a bone marrow transplant, chemotherapy, and weeks of hospitalization. That's why so precious. the medication is so important Thank because you. it keeps her from getting sick. Her mom, Sarah Pruitt, says the insurance recently stopped paying for medicine that protects Aurelia from deadly fungal infections. What was your reaction when you heard no more meds? I started crying and screaming, and I said, my daughter needs this medicine. In this October denial letter, Amerigroup states the policy only covers veroniconazole for the primary treatment of a fungal infection. But in Aurelia's case, it's needed as a preventative. By the time you actually find out she has this fungal, it's too late. I reached out to Amerigroup three times in three days. And on the third day, the insurance company sent Sarah this letter. It states, quote, we feel treatment is medically necessary for your child, and as a result, we're changing our previous decision. If you hadn't gotten involved, I don't know if they would have ever called me. Another battle won in Aurelia's fight for life. My mom called me. And we connected Sarah with Pfizer's patient program. The drug maker is processing her request, which may grant Aurelia the medicine free of charge. Jackie Calloway, taking action for you. And in the meantime, the family has set up a GoFundMe page to raise money for Aurelia's medical expenses. We have that link on our website right now. Just go to abcactionnews.com and click on links as well as info.